Hello everyone and I am here with our next contestant, Alankrita Shahi. Hello. Hi. And you look lovely in pink. Thank you so much and so do you. <laughs> Thank you. So let's get into our interview. Sure. As a pageant girl and an ED advocate, do you think the pressure of pageants lead to their contestants developing eating disorders? So I would like to say that eating disorder is such a common disorder which we all have been facing in this 21st century because of so many things. Maybe it's just the perfectionism of looking good or social media pressure. Mm -hmm. And if we look at our field, the glamour field, the entertainment industry, there's much more pressure over here because we are always of the mindset that we have to look good. But we should ensure and we should make sure that it's not always having the perfect body but it's all also maintaining that healthy body. So I think it's very important to have that mental peace and that mental peace will help us getting away from eating disorder. Absolutely. So, uh, you know, keeping in the same conversation, please tell us more about your journey from a victim of this condition to an advocate for it. So I would say that it was a very dark and a tough phase for me in my life, but I was very sure that I'm going to get through it and I ensured that howsoever difficult the times are, there are going to be a day when the sun is going to rise for me and one day it came and that day I realized that it should, this is one area where I need to, where I should work towards because it's something which is very close to me because I have personally faced it. So why not this platform is going to give me one great platform GSI is so I want to make the best use of it and help promote eating disorder as one of the major social mm -hmm. causes which we all should work towards. That's actually pretty inspiring. I cannot imagine where you've been and I think we're all proud that you know you've made your journey better out Thank of you. it. Thank you so much. Uh, so with that let's move on to our next question. What piece of advice would you give to the next generation? So the one piece of advice which I would give to the next generation is believe in yourself, have faith and be confident. There's nobody perfect out there and everybody has their own problem, own issues. So just believe in yourself and give your best shot and you're going to make the best of this life. Lovely. Thank you. So with this, let's move to the last question of our interview. Do we need politics and politicians in this world? I think it's a very important question, mm -hmm. looking at the political situation around the world. But I do feel that we need politics and politicians because as a responsible citizen, there are people who needs to maintain the law and order, who needs to take care of the people. And it's a very important role which anybody plays today because politician is someone who are like the some representing all of us, all the country. So their whole idea, their whole mindset represents us. Mm -hmm. So I do feel it's important and selecting and choosing the right person is more important. So make the best use of your voting right as a citizen of a democratic country. Lovely. So it was a very insightful conversation with you and best of luck for your finale. Thank you so much. Thank you.